Hello, today we have uh, another Lenovo laptop. The model is uh, Lenovo G700. The problem with this laptop is uh, it doesn't charge, it doesn't power on. Uh, basically, it's dead. Uh, I did check the charger, the charger is okay, so we'll open the laptop and check uh, what's going on. Usually, those models have a very <coughs> particular problem with the charging port which is around the, the hinge and sometimes one of the pins got broken and uh, the laptop doesn't start at all so we'll open the laptop and we're gonna check what's going on inside we're gonna remove the battery Now we're going to remove all the screws on the back and we're going to disassemble it. Let's first take out the hard drive. this Oops. Mm. let's disconnect the Wi-Fi because nah, the Wi-Fi should stay I think we, we will not to remove the board for now so let's proceed <coughs> We have a lot of screws to remove, so you can rewind a little bit. All the screws should be the same size, except the ones which are holding the keyboard. Is that better? No. Okay. Mm. have a screw which is on the other side mounted incorrectly We have to remove the panel also because it has screws which are held on the other side to the other plastic. Uh, we have a screw here, a little battery. Let's double check because I always forget a, a screw in case. And here we have a lot. I think it's all okay. <clears throat> now we have to remove the keyboard. We'll use something sharp. Just a second. Sorry about that. 
we're gonna leave the keyboard we're gonna open it now we have a few more screws here have to disconnect the uh, this is broken somebody already fixed this laptop before yeah here is broken also hmm. will be interesting now we have to separate the plastic No screws, weird. I think the connector was repaired before and it's glued. Oh, no. All looks fine here. We have 20 volts, we have 3 volts, no actually we don't, oh yeah, we have 3 volts on the BIOS chip and let's see, yeah we have 3 volts on the power button Could it be just a frozen BIOS? Let's see. I think I saw a battery. Yeah. Which is also good. Let's reset it. Yeah, and we have picture. Oh, 
correctly. So the problem of the laptop was just a frozen BIOS. Basically, we disassembled the laptop for nothing. Right now it's boot looping because there is no hard drive on the laptop. <sighs> Basically a little waste of time, but yeah. So next time, first check whether we have a frozen BIOS or not. After that, just proceed with, with the disassembly. That's it for now. Bye-bye.